Hi Facebook and YouTube, it is your girl Maximilian, Miss Beauty 101, coming to you today with this video. Um, excuse my nails, I have to finish them. I have decided to do somewhat of a stiletto nail this time. If you pay attention to any of my other uh, videos, I normally do square or I normally, well, I always do square, and then sometimes I might do oval, sometimes. But this time, I wanted to go more of a stiletto type of nail. And they are the more of a um, natural type of tip, so let me just say that. And excuse this hand, I end up taking these three nails off. I'm going to redo them, but just excuse that for right now, okay? Um, I just wanted to do a quick well, I don't know if this is going to be a quick video, so if it is a long video, please excuse me. And please let me say, all three of my kids is here, so if they come in here and interrupt this video, please excuse that as well. Uh, so, yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay, I wanted to let you guys know that I didn't, um... Okay, first off, this is a sew-in. I end up um, having my best friend do me a sew in because normally you guys normally I'm the one that normally do my hair but I got tired of doing my hair so I just asked her can she do me a sew in which she did it for me so thanks BS um I didn't almost had this sew in for a month almost I only got one more week left and then I would have this in for a month um as far as the color I end up dying this hair myself um the kit i end up using was black in the color luscious raspberry um if you guys know that product you know that that color is way more brighter than this which um i did not leave the product on as long as the instructions told me to so it came up with like this burgundy type of color with some orange type of kind of highlights in it but whatever but no 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 it's okay man you don't gotta cry but um yeah this is the color that i came up with when i ended up dying the hair i was trying to go for an aubrey effect but i still like the effect that it came out with it's not too bright and it's not too dull and the color it is in the sun it comes up a little more brighter but it is like a burgundy type of color um i'm actually liking this color i think it goes well with my skin complexion i think it just makes me stand out a little more um yes and the type of hair this is the top is bobby Bo i mean is it yeah bobby boss indian remy and the bottom is first remy I know those are two different kind of brands, but they by the same person. But I said whatever. I'm just going to mix two different boxes, and this is what I got. And originally, the Indian Remy was black, but I ended up dying it, like I said, to this burgundy color. And the back is black, um, and the bottom, like I said, is first Remy, and the top is Indian Remy. Um... The inches, I don't really know. Oh, excuse me, child. <laughs> I don't really know the inches, but I can show you guys um, how far it comes down on me. So, this is how long it is. And sorry if it look like scraggly at the ends or whatever. I'm about to go um, flat iron it. But this is how long it come down to me. Mommy, or whatever. I get bloody. And um, in a minute, Kim. Yeah. But um, I'm loving the hair. I think it's good quality hair. Um, compared to a lot of hairs that I didn't use before, I think that um, this is decent here no go play i told you guys to go play you about to get whatever you wanted in one second thank you um but yeah i think it's good quality here um i flexi rotted it a few times and it curls pretty um good it curls decent um what else um what else i wanted to say about the hair um to me it takes color pretty well um like i told you i done had this in for a month and the color 
Um, I wouldn't say and fade it. I wouldn't say and fade it at all. But it's like I can't explain it. But um, yeah, the hair is still soft. It's not damaged. It don't feel dry. Um, I do not. What you talking about? I do not add any products to my hair. The only thing I do is flick my edges down with either my uh, edge control or my gel. Um, hey, man. Hey, what you doing? What's your problem? <laughs> well, that's my uh, latest baby that I had. Yes, I have three kids plus a stepson, so I have four. Um... And I love all of my kids, even my stepson. I love all of them. So it's just, it is amazing to be a mom. Like even on my hard days, I still enjoy being a mom. I find it to be a wonderful gift because a lot of women are not able to have kids. And I just thank God for blessing me with me and my family. Um, I do not want any more kids. <laughs> I do not want any more kids. Like I said, they are a blessing. God blessed me with four, and that's all I need. Um, me and my hubby is happy with four, so that's it. We don't need no more, okay? Um, but, oh, yeah, YouTube and Facebook. Um, if you haven't followed me on Facebook, I have recently announced that I got a job. So, for the last few years, I have been a stay-at-home mom um, raising my three kids because I just felt like that would be better right until they get a little bit older to um, get a job. So I got a job. Yay for me. I'm so excited. I start this week and like I aced the interview. When I say I aced the interview, I aced it. But I have to be truthful. Like I was scared in the mug at the interview. Like I was really nervous. Before I got there, I kept telling myself like, okay. Just calm down. You got this. You know what you're doing. You got this. And I aced it. And I was just so proud of myself. And my hubby is, like, so proud. And everybody is just so happy for me. They just, like, congratulations. And, of course, I'm like, oh, thank you. But, yeah, I just want to show you guys my excitement. Yay. So, um, yeah, but I would definitely be coming back when I can to do videos. To let you guys see some makeup tutorials or when I do my own hair, I might do some hair installments or some things of that nature. So please continue to watch my videos. Let me know what type of videos you guys would like to see me do because I would love to just do certain videos that you guys would like to see. Um, and like I said, uh, I do my own eyebrows. This is how I do my eyebrows. And I use a... um. A razor the little the ones you buy at the beauty supply that's what I use to do my eyebrows and I do have on some lashes um, actually <laughs> these are the same pairs that I just reused um, I have only three pairs of lashes right now and what I end up doing is I noticed lately since I have my hair like this I've been wanting to wear lashes because normally when I wear my lashes I take them off the same day but lately I just been in the mood to like just keep them on and like just go with it but that's lately but normally I don't leave them on but lately I just been in the mood to leave them on but these are the elf natural eyelashes that I have on right now and if you're wondering what I have on my lips if you can see that that will be my baby soft lips in berry bomb like I told you guys I love this product I think it's an excellent product. I have, I think, all six so far. I think I have six so far, and I think it's like eight. I don't know. Don't quote me. But I have like six of them so far. I do want to go back and get some more, which I will be going to go get some Ah, I will be going to go get some more. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to share my excitement with y'all. Let you in on things that's going on in my life. And if you wonder what type of earrings I have on... Hey man, what's wrong? I have on my hard little earrings with my cross earrings, which I fell in love with these earrings, y'all. Like these. Hey man, KJ, KJ, 
sheepy. They're baby sheepy. It's your baby sheepy. Sorry, y'all. But, um, yes, like I was saying, I have fell in love with these earrings. Like, y'all, y'all don't even know. Like, I love these earrings. I have three pair of these earrings. I have them in clear, blue, and purple. Because, like I told you guys, when I, fell in, when I fall in love with something, I, like, really, really fall in love with it, okay? When I say I fall in love... I fall in love with both. But, um, other than that, everything is short. Ziggity, ziggy, 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 boo. But yeah, y'all, I just wanted to give y'all that little video real fast. Sorry that it's so long. But, yeah, so, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. And, oh, yeah, um, I forgot to tell you guys, I actually perned the first Remy hair. I actually perned this one, the black hair, I perned it. So you see how that just goes straight through? Let me see how many strands. Really? No strands. See, look. No, maybe if I pull on it. Woo! Do y'all see that? No strands. See, look. And I done dyed this hair. Okay. There go one strand. Y'all see that one little strand? You see that? One strand, y'all. And I done did all types of stuff to this hair. Like, y'all, look. Okay. It get tangled. You see that? But all you got to do is do that. That's all you gotta do for well, You see this? Look. Still nothing. I don't got nothing. Nothing, y'all, nothing. Look. And I'm pulling. I'm pulling. Look. Now that might have something. Okay. Now, see this? I had to pull like seven, several times to get that much here. And y'all seen how many times I pulled. So I had to pull like hard to get some strands. Like, I had to pull hard. Y'all. And let me tell y'all. I didn't use this hair. The first time I got this hair was some months ago. The first time, the first four times I used this hair, I did nothing but quick weaves when I used this hair. And I'm just talking about. The first Remy. I mean, the uh, Indian Remy, not the first Remy. Whatever, because I just got the first Remy. I play with the crayon now. No, y'all can't play with the crayon. Okay, no. 